Hello, I'm Anna Hank, and I'd like to present a brand for Honeydew Bee Company. As a startup, Honeydew Bee has a lot of potential. The brand capitalizes on that potential with a rustic, modern, and clean redesign that captures attention and creates a lasting impression. Using modern branding techniques, the reinvention of Honeydew Bee Company will be a journey, including everything from a color palette and typography to the brand experience as a whole. There are a lot of local honey competitors out there, but by working to capture the audience and build a strong online presence, Honey Doobie will be able to hold its own by carving out a unique niche. Most competitors rely upon color palettes that are primarily gold and black, and their honey isn't nearly as local as they claim it to be. The benefits of eating local honey are numerous, and Honey Doobie Company will focus on sharing these facts as a main differentiation factor. In addition to education and selling only local honey, another differentiation factor from the competitors will be the use of white space. The Honeydew Bee logo is warm and friendly, using the hexagon shape to form the letters and reinforce the honey connection. Honeydew Bee is all about being warm, fresh, and appealing. Bright colors, each one inspired by nature, make up the color palette. They are utilized, in this example, to welcome visitors to the website. The main page is gold, black, and gray. The subsequent sample pages, like the store and the blog, utilize additional bright natural shades from the palette to create a welcoming feel. The experience of Honey Doobie will be consistent across all print and online media. The project plan includes company assets, the store and the website, ensuring that every part of the plan is linked to the overall vision. There are common branding elements, as displayed by the pages from the style guide. An example are clean images that speak directly to the consumer about the quality of the product. Combined with these images are different typefaces that blend well together, each serving a unique purpose. Tahoma is the main font for subhead and online text. Halo hand letter is a secondary font used only where highly stylized fonts are appropriate. Minion Pro is used for text font on print materials. Graphical elements like the hexagon paired with the horizontal line are repeated throughout to reinforce consistency and create a simple and seamless design, both in the style guide and in collateral. Let's look at a few design examples. A closer look at the website fonts reveal that Tahoma keeps it modern with a hint of rustic fun in the halo hand letter. The amount of text on each page is pleasant to read and not overwhelming. Finally, the tablet and mobile apps take the same website and winnow the information down to just the right amount for each medium so the reader is not overwhelmed. The print media also has a warm feel with white space and clean, bright images. Notice that this trifold brochure has several educational sections as well as products and contact information. The billboards are simple and elegant, playing to the customer's sense of humor while also giving clear directions to the store. They match the campaign with a simple design and use of white space. The company assets include stationery and business cards. These assets also utilize the horizontal line and hexagon shapes to create a seamless transition in the branding material. The promotional items, the candles and the air freshener, both play with the sense of smell and are intended to make the customer wonder about the taste of Honey Do Bee Honey. Those were just a few of the possibilities for this exciting Honey Doobie rebrand. The vision behind this entire branding campaign is to help this vibrant company grow a solid foundation with a strong brand. Thank you for your time.